<laughs> Coach Morris, I got a lot of funny stories about Coach Morris. I want to think which which one should I tell? We are I, we are actually mocking him on the way up here. And Coach Morris has a saying that when you get in trouble, he says he's going to drop you in the grease. And so, and so, we had people getting we had people uh, messing around at practice, and he said he, in the meeting he was like, I'll "Tell you one thing, I told you not to do it, but it'll never happen again. Because now I'm about to drop you in the grease." <laughs> so. Everybody, if they bring up dropping somebody in the grease, then he knows it's, it's bad news. <laughs> I remember the first time I met him. Um, it was right after the season. He came into the locker room and talked to us. And he looked at me and he's like, what do you play? I was like, well, I'm a defensive lineman. He's like, hmm, okay. Next time I see him, he's like, you're an offensive lineman now. I'm like, okay. Any specific reasons? He's like, have you have you looked in the mirror? I was like, yeah, every day. I was like, well, then you know why. I'm like, okay, that's good. And he's, yeah, I mean, there's a ton of small moments where he has something subtle to say, and it's just, you once you think of it, you're like, yeah, I guess he was right. You know, it's 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 great. And he's very down to earth, so it's it's awesome. After the good tight games, or maybe a, a rough game that we pulled out. He always, everybody's just sitting around the locker room. He always just come out with a serious look on his face, like he's just about to tear the offense apart, tear the defense apart, but be like, all right, we won the game, let's go home. He comes out, he'll look at us, he'll just look around. It'd be complete silent. All right, listen up, listen up, listen up. And he gets like, ah! Everybody just gets riled up. There's a lot of videos on it, but he's a really funny guy. He gets our, gets our spirits going. But when we was out paintballing, I had an opportunity to shoot at him from like afar, but he started running. I ain't seen him run that fast. He was scared to get shot. That was really my favorite moment of me, you know, <laughs> of me and him. <laughs> it was my freshman year, and you know, we kind of, we got into it a little bit on the field. And he said, you know what, you're hot. He kicked me off the field. Like, you know what, call your parents, you know, take all that stuff off, you're going home. And it was crazy because as I walked to the sideline, he was like, if you cross that line, then you're really going home. So then, I, you know, as a freshman, you're like, you're just out there just lost. Like, you don't know what to do. You don't know how, you know, if he was serious or not. And then he called me back over there and we talked. And that's a moment, like, I know both of us will never forget.